A few months ago, we installed a brand new system for Mr. S, and after much deliberation, he settled on 22 sleek all black Viridian in roof panels. This totaled 9.72 kilowatt peak, which with the two power twos he had installed will be enough to get him 63% grid independent over the year. He also opted for two 22 kilowatt Zappi EV charge points to go on his three phase electric supply. As you can see, we think the final installation looks great. In my day to day as head of sales here at Spirit Energy, we are seeing more and more inquiries for in-roof solar PV systems. This is because it looks much neater on the roof. You can do away with any gap or bird guard below the panels. And if you're re-roofing, you can save on the cost of the new tiles where those PV panels are going to be located. This installation was a bit trickier than other in-roof systems because it was spread over a few orientations. The hardest part of installing the in-roof system is working the tiles and flashing sections at the edges. So you want to try and minimize the perimeter of the system and have panels as blocked together as possible for the best Best value installation. The power batteries will store excess solar PV energy, they'll provide single phase power cut protection and they'll also allow off-peak charging so Mr S can catalyze on lower grid rates when solar production is lower in the winter time. Tesla also offers great monitoring through their app which shows how much energy is generated, consumed and exported at any given time. The smart Zappi electric vehicle charge points will allow him to charge his electric vehicles with the cheapest available electricity at night. Tok and the team made a great video on charging your EV with solar not long ago, so check that out if you're just like Mr S and you want to cut your energy bills and drive on sunshine while keeping your roof looking great as well.